Across the whole state of Nebraska, we have 11 different types of frogs and toads. All but one are native and been here for eons. The one that's not native is getting to start to take over the rest of them and causing problems. And that's the American bullfrog. Data indicates that they weren't original in Nebraska, but brought here by French fur traders in the 1800s. But now, with the reservoirs and a change in habitat, these bullfrogs are not only taken over, they're eating all our other native frogs. And they're not only just eating frogs, they're eating fish, game fish, believe it or not, a lot of birds. Now, they are a game species. They're the only species of amphibians in the state of Nebraska that the Game Commission considers a game species. There's a season and a limit. So, how are we going to solve this invasive problem? Think of the bullfrogs like cockroaches or invasive grubs, Japanese beetles. Therefore, we need to decrease their numbers and increase the numbers of frogs that should be here. Think about getting a fishing license, getting in the outdoors during the right time of year, and utilizing these frogs as a food source. Their legs make a great meal, and when you can use these to cook them and barbecue them, and they'll be a great way to decrease this invasive species. If you're not into f eating frog legs to decrease the numbers, another way you can decrease the numbers and help our native frogs and toads in your own ponds or even backyard ponds is not have fish. The bullfrog is the only frog in Nebraska in which the tadpoles are distasteful to fish. Our other native frogs, tadpoles get eaten by fish. So if we decrease the number of fish in the ponds, increase the number of native frogs and toads, we won't have problems with the bullfrog and it won't be taking over all our frogs and toads. If you like them in the pond, build a pond. Believe it or not, even though they're our largest frog in the state of Nebraska, they have the smallest home range and they will stick around your pond and in June you can hear them. So either enjoy them by watching them or enjoy them by tasting them.